All right, guys, so for this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use Cheat Engine on the Opera browser. For this example, I'm going to be using the Opera games. So first things first, when you open Cheat Engine, you can't really attach to the first window you see for Opera because you might see one window here. But if we go to Processes and we type in Opera, there's like a million of these. If you just attach to the, this one right here, you're just going to attach to the actual window and not the process of the tab that you want. So what we're going to do is, we're going to close that. I'm going to click up here in the top left, go to Developer, and Task Manager. And here you're going to find that tab you want. If you have multiple tabs open, you'll see more. Let me show you. You'll see more tabs, but here it is. So we're going to copy that process ID. It's 5216. We're going to go to Cheat Engine. We're going to open here. Go to Processes. We can type in Opera. And then we're going to right click and convert PID to decimal because it's in hex. And you're going to find 54, 16, 52, 16, was it? You're going to attach. And let's try it on a random game. Let's try, what is this? You can try it on pinball. So there's a few settings I want to sh you guys should turn on. First of all, you want to have writable on. This means um, it scans writable memory as well. Only writable memory. For executable, we don't really care if the memory is executable. We just want to scan it. And here in settings, um, we're going to go to scan settings and you want to enabled mem mapped. Okay. So for most of these games uh, coded in JavaScript, they're going to use doubles and four bytes. So most of the time, you just want to scan for all and go for rounded default. So let's try let's try changing the value of the the auto ball. Let's level one. And a quick tip: if you're ever scanning for something, most of the time, don't try to scan it when it's at zero because it's going to take forever, so you usually try to get it at another value. So let's try one. First scan. Three. Next scan. And five. Next scan. Hopefully we get one. Okay. And if we change it to 200, there we go. Massive amount of balls. Let me try something else. Let me try the round trade as well. Get it to two. Just want to see what this looks like. Three and four. Um, probably the only double like the other one. Let's do two hundred. And there we go. <laughs> well, anyways, I hope that helped. And thanks for watching.